And here to sort all this out is Karen Myers, a dietitian and nutritionist who works with Oklahoma's beef industry. So this is all getting a little confusing. So should I eat less meat or should I eat more meat? It's all about moderation. Um, we know that good health is determined by many things. It's determined by exercise. It's determined by not smoking, alcohol in moderation, maintaining a healthy body weight, and very important, eating a well-balanced, nutrient-rich diet in, in moderation. So what is moderation then when it comes to eating meat? Well, the food guidance systems tell us that we should eat about five and a half ounces of meat a day. Now, we just saw why protein is so important as we, we age, but protein is something that we need throughout our life? Absolutely. It's very important for growing and for being healthy. You know, we know that protein also plays a role in weight management, so protein makes you feel full longer. We know that protein as we get older is very important because you saw the, the sarcopenia is the age-related loss of muscle. And muscle's important as we get older in preventing falls. And there's increasing evidence that if we begin to lose muscle, that that leads to, can lead to a three to four times increased risk of developing some kind of chronic disability. So we wanna maintain that muscle mass and lean beef can, can actually help with that. Now, you brought with you here the, the Healthy Beef Cookbook along with uh, 29 Ways to Love Lean Beef. Where can people find this information? They can go on www.beefitswhatsfordinner.com and download the, the information about the 29 lean cuts of beef. It comes in a small card that you can fold up and put in your pocket or your purse so that you can make good choices. The cookbook is also available on the website.